has been providing beautiful flower arrangements to his customers. But he, like many businesses, is dealing with the pain of price inflation. ABC 7's Kitty Frazier reports. I spoke with Rafael Delphine, the owner of Heaven Sent Florist, and he told me about some of the difficulties he's had maintaining his flower shop due to inflation. Prices have been up for a long time. Delphine, who comes from southern Mexico, has been in the florist business for decades. But this year, selling his flowers is costing customers more than ever. Since everything has gone up, there's no way for, uh, for me, since I'm a small shop, to give you a lesser price. Reason being is I'm a small place. I don't buy by the millions. And transportation has taken a toll on his business too. Right now, it has to be cheap. Everything has to be here, which I'm behind because of transportation. Airplanes are behind. The trucking system is not working as he used to, and everything doubled up in price. Delphine stays busy with delayed shipments of his flowers. I've been getting shipments, one, two, three, four, every day almost. Because someone don't make the airplane, they switch it to another one, and then the holds back, and then a little bit gets here, a little bit there. And today, the amount of flowers he buys is much less than what he used to manage just a few years ago. And this time around, I only have less than half what I used to buy. Even though inflation has raised his prices, the range and quality of flowers has stayed the same. There's ladies that come, they, they, they ask me that they have the flowers after 20, 25 days. And they ask me, what do you, what do, you do to the flowers that they last so long? I sing to them, that's what I say. <laughs> they, they crack up. Valentine's Day is right around the corner and flowers may be the perfect gift for your loved one. Katie Frazier, ABC7.